Hey guys, this is Sean Ralu. How's everybody doing today? On the last episode, we actually did our expeditions, except we didn't actually do any work. We actually went around and actually uh, sort of uh, went other places with Mew, started looking around to see if there's any males for other Pokemon. Apparently not, and no friendship for us either. And of course, uh, I also went in a dungeon that has nothing to do with our, um, our, um, our adventures of like, you know, expeditions and all that. But, uh, got some good, a little bit of levels, and, uh, also, um, yeah, we actually did really great. So, let's continue this on. The next morning. Good morning, Kira. Let's work hard out, let's work, let's work hard out there again today. Give it a lot there, you team. Yes, sir. So we're going to keep on doing that until we actually get to the story point because we're still in like a, the mid story of it, even though that the previous stories are actually uh, finished. But uh, after doing a lot of expeditions and, uh, you know, uh, so far, I think it would be time for us to like, you know, level up as much as we can and uh, just like, you know, get all this done. And Zerati is still asleep. <laughs> OK, so uh, apparently there's no uh, items out here. But uh, we're not going to go to any other continents to see what we can find anymore because we're going to keep on doing what we did before. And hey, uh, get a load of this. I finally found a job. Um, I, I'll be delivering milk. Pretty cool, huh? Congratulations, Crocodile. Well, apparently he actually um, he did something right for a change. He's no longer the uh, notorious crook anymore. That's fucking awesome. That's fucking awesome, Crocodile. Good on you. I know you. I know you shouldn't be congratulating someone who almost like uh, tried to ruin the expeditions and all that. But hey, at least he did something right. That should be a good thing, you know. Okay, so apparently I don't have any more. Uh, let me guess. Uh, what are you doing? Okay, so, um, I want to, like, uh, let's see here. I have a feeling, no. Okay. Uh, let's see here. I want to, okay, that was really fucking strange. No, 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 no. Okay, so, let's see here. Got plenty of orange berries. Got so many reviver seeds. Okay, so... I don't need HP. I do need stay away. Uh, switch a rond I can get rid of. Um, also, I don't need that one anymore either. So, okay. So now that I got the treasure boxes, I uh, might as well go see uh, Klefki, shall we? So what we got? Sunny day. Okay. Uh, what else do we get? Um, Max Ether, okay. That's pretty cool. Not really much if I expected, but, um, I guess we don't have any golden blocks. Yep, that's what I thought. Oh my god. <gasps> Mommy! Oh my god, this guy's creepy! Okay, so, um... Uh, uh, let's see here. I, need, I do need to get more of my apples. Okay, so, uh, let's, uh, withdraw... Okay, so let's uh, get me uh, some apples. Okay, wow, I got 52 of those things? Damn! Okay, so I think that's uh, that's about it. Uh, my guess is that uh, there's nothing new uh, down here. Nope, no uh, items out here. Okay, so uh, we're going to save the game. And no, 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 no. We're going to save the game. And uh, then we're going to do a little bit more exploring. And if you guys are thinking, well, why not you explore somewhere else? Like, uh, get more experience from there. I would, but if I got to be honest with you guys, it's better to be actually safe than sorry, you know? Okay, so let's see here. Because uh, there is some, like, uh, dungeons that could actually be good exploring. But in other words... Uh, I, I do not like to go anything else, you know. Okay, so we're going to go to uh, Pee Wee Meadow. 
that actually does sound a little strange by hearing that name. I have a funny feeling that Salamence is... Yep. Okay, so Dragonite is... Yep. I'm gonna go all the way to 18. See what we can find. Let's see here. So, uh, Minectra can probably be good. Vespaquin. Um... Let's see here. Needle Queen could be a good one. Uh, Wigglytuff is out of a, a mission. Tangro. Um. Uh, let's see here. No, Snorlax is not a very strong Pokemon. Uh, let's see here. Um. Which ones would be good? This sounds really good. You know what? Let's have uh, Alakazam with us. From the, um, from his old team. That's freaking awesome. Okay, so we're gonna go and travel around. So I have, uh, Power Power uh, Power Boost X. Oh my goodness, I couldn't even say the word. I gotta say, guys, I really do love Alakazam. Don't get me wrong. Alakazam is an awesome Pokemon. Okay. So that one's done. Oh boy. Wham! Haha. <laughs> so, I really do love Alakazam, and especially when I saw, like, um, how Chega Conroy did the, uh, uh, Mystery Dungeon, uh, DX. And I have to say, guys, it's a pretty awesome way that, um, that Alakazam looks so calm and cool and just freaking. Oh no! Thank you, Mew. Um, so calm and cool, and then, uh, also, um, like, how he, how he actually is a bit concerned about all these things, you know? So, I find him really awesome. And, uh, even though that Alakazam is actually my favorite Pokemon in the world. And, uh, here's a reason I actually, uh, remember the part that I actually, uh, created, uh, that I actually played one of my Pokemon games? Oh, super critical, thank you! So remember how I actually, uh, um, how I played uh, one of my uh, Pokemon games, um, that, um, I think it was, uh, Alpha Sapphire, was it? Yeah, I think it was Alpha Sapphire. So, the, the first time I actually uh, played Alpha Sapphire, um, for recording with you guys, um, oh no. So, what's really cool is that somehow, uh, I'm not gonna be able to make it, nope. Die! So, um, anyways. So, I really do remember how my Alakazam, or, uh, my Kenji, for example, was actually a really good Pokemon. And, uh, I really do miss, uh, doing that. And, oh! There's a traveling Pokemon! Okay, so in other words, we're gonna go find the traveling Pokemon. So, I know this may sound be stupid and all, but it's best way to actually, like, uh, find some traveling Pokemon before doing the expeditions, to be perfectly honest. And, uh, I gotta say, guys, even though that it sounds stupid of me to do that, but no. Um, but, um, but it's a good way to actually, like, uh, travel and, uh, travel around and find some Pokemon to, uh, have a talk to or travel around with. And, uh, yeah, it's just one of those times that it's actually a really good idea to do it. Okay, so... As I was saying before about um, Kadabra and Alakazam, they're really good Pokemon. And uh, there has been like some people that say, oh, it's not a good Pokemon at all. Well, sucks to be you, because I have to say, these Pokemon are pretty fantastic. So, it's a really good way to actually use these kind of Pokemon, to be perfectly honest, and... HOLY SHIT! <laughs> SPEAK OF THE DEVIL! <laughs> Speak of <laughs> That's fucking awesome! <laughs> Are you kidding me? I was just talking about him! And now you just literally came out of nowhere! <laughs> 
want to escape the dungeon. Holy shit! <laughs> just when I was in the middle of talking about uh, Kadabra and Alakazam, and just a moment on, the freaking Kadabra just came out of nowhere! <laughs> Uh, no, I don't want to skip the dungeons. Yes, I'd like to go on. Oh my. <laughs> Holy shit, monkeys. I find that. I find that so fucking funny. And I got poisoned by Poison Point. Oh my god. <laughs> oh shit. That is very funny as hell. I would. I gotta be honest with you guys. I didn't even expect of that. I'm dead serious. I didn't even expect of it. And just when I was like thinking, okay, uh, is there gonna be? Oh, well, there's a freaking. <laughs> there's a freaking Katabra just came out of nowhere. <laughs> oh my god, I. I got no words of this. I got no words whatso fucking ever. Oh my god. That was very funny. I didn't expect that was gonna happen, to be perfectly fucking honest. That was literally funny as hell. Oh my god, I think I needed a good laugh. Holy shit. I mean, I, I didn't even know that was gonna happen, to be honest. I didn't even, I didn't even thought that there was gonna be like a freaking. I didn't even know that there was gonna be a freaking uh, cadaver here on this floor. All I know is it says that, that there's gonna be a traveling Pokemon that's going to be like uh, helping us out. And I gotta be honest with you guys. I, I was just middle of talking about that. And then all of a sudden a freaking cadaver just came out of fucking nowhere. Uh, I needed a good chuckle. I really needed a good chuckle. Hello, buddy. I really needed a good chuckle. That was funny as hell. Uh, but yes, it's always a good idea to actually, like, uh, travel around in the, uh, the, the dungeons and, uh, to see if there's any, uh, freaking Pokemon to actually, like, uh, freaking, uh, battle against. And, uh, also, uh, for the good reason of it is, uh, to, like, um, to actually, like, um, get a good, get a good experience and also get some traveling Pokemon to just, uh, you know, be friends with. And, uh, it's a really simple way to do that, you know? So, if you never want to, like, uh, see me travel like that, that's okay, guys. Because, um, because you can always, like, skip it, or I can actually, like, pause it for you. It doesn't really matter to me, because all that matters is I'm just, like, getting through to the dungeon so I can actually, uh, end off the game. Because you know what's gonna happen, and, uh, you're thinking, oh, well, I think I know what's gonna happen, because I played this game so many fucking times. Well, if I gotta be honest with you guys... I never played this game in my entire fucking life. Except for, like, trying it out my first time, and I didn't even think that was actually a good idea. Like, I didn't even like this kind of dungeons. And, uh, that's just the thing I actually get, you know? Because I didn't really like these dungeons at all, and... Thinking, okay, well, those are nothing more than just a fucking waste of time. So, yeah, it's just one of those things I do not like to play mystery dungeons whatsoever. Because I didn't think they were actually uh, good ones, you know? I mean, they really do have good storylines. Don't get me wrong. And, uh, if I gotta be honest with you... Oh, what do we got? Oh, gold bar. Cool. Uh, if I gotta be honest with you, because, um... Even though that the Mystery Dungeons have really good storylines, don't get me wrong. I really love the storylines. They're the same thing that I actually, uh, watch the storylines, uh... Either from watching YouTube from other people playing it, or... Uh, people started, like, uh, giving you that kind of, uh, reading or say which ones that you should, uh, understand it more. And, uh, yeah, it's just one of those things that is actually a really, uh, good chance to, like, you know, get through of all this. So, yeah, it's just, uh, one of those things that, um, is a very good way to freaking you know, play the game yourself. But, 
I never like the dungeons. I never do. And I, uh, and I don't know how to explain now that I get yeah, you, fucker. Thank you. And, uh, if I gotta be honest with you, I just, I just never... Bitch! So, yeah, it's just, uh, it's just those things I don't really like to do, you know? And, uh, okay, so I'm gonna swap that one. Let's see here. <clears throat> I don't need slow orb. I know I should actually use it for, like, slowing down Pokemon, but I don't see any reason to do that. Okay, so, anyways, I, I just never was a fan of Mystery Dungeons, and, uh, I, I love watching other people play it because I've seen, like, uh, the reactions that they actually been doing, and it's really hysterical. So, yeah, it's just one of those things that it's really good to actually see all these people's reaction or hear the reaction. And then they started freaking out for a very funny reason. We had another great day, huh, Kira? You really seem ha uh, ha uh, to have uh, become part of the of the life here. Working for the Expedition Society is sure is a lot of fun. Uh, uh, we. Uh, we get to go all kinds of places and meet all 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 the Pokemon there. Hey, Kira, before I came here, you had another partner named Froki, right? I bet Froki had a had a great had a really great time here too. But now Froki's gone away. I bet Froki must uh, must be really sad about that. I sure hope. That your friend Froki comes back soon. Uh, come back, come back soon. <sighs> well, I'm pretty bushed. I'm going to hit the hay. Nighty night, Kira. Mew. Thank you. Okay, I know it seemed a bit early, but uh, we're going to end off the video right here. Because uh, I'm guessing this is going to be one hell of an adventure. I promise you that, guys. Okay, so in the meantime, guys, please make a like down below and also subscribe. And if you want to comment to me, please feel free. Hope you guys have a wonderful, beautiful day.